G'day and welcome back to our PR Empire campaign in EU4. So I was uh, pretty focused down on what we were doing in Austria. Um, Russia can go and do the rest of that. And I'd actually forgotten that the war is actually a Russian war for Ubu. So Russia's been up there doing all this and he's about to take the Swedish capital, which I think Sweden's finally realised. Don't know why they were so concerned about Austria having Vienna occupied. Um, also means we are just going to go sit on random stuff down here. Because I don't think they're going to be stupid enough to attack. Alright, Frankfurt's out. Good. Forced to give Russia ducats. Fine. Russians attacking Austria in Tyrol. Alright, um, we'll let it fall and then we'll come back and grab it. And the Swedes don't seem to care they're losing their capital. Alright, got the Graz. Um, let's just drop one guy up there, to which friendlies may attach, because otherwise nothing will happen. Um, we'll split a guy off. What do we got? One of them. Go up there and be useful. And once we've got that, we'll put our siege guy in charge. Alright, Cinder for you of a Jai Salma. We need the three siege, come down, and then we don't merge them. And we grab admin tech, with no penalty yet. Two years off. And war's over. Alright, Sweden gives Russia ducats, and Niles with Great Britain, good. Um, we get most of the money, and he didn't end up taking any land anyway. We get 39 favours with Russia, holy crap. Alright, um... These guys really just need to get home. Go to Krakow. And one more Bastion to finish. We lost Siegfried Stirner. That's eh, okay. Let's see what the ones we need. Alright, marriage with Bohemia. We accept. Access from Savoy. We decline. And that is a huge stack when they rebuild. So, it's just... Keep them apart. It's going to take a lot of years. Alright, recall from Bohemia. Recall from Mainz. Recall from Salzburg. The boats are fine. We're losing a lot because we um, did the thing to Bohemia. Forgot that you lose Imperial Authority as well as the um, people's opinion of you. But that's fine. Would we have been able to pass it now anyway? 5 to 23, not at the moment. No was worried. Lose stability. Sure, why not? Okay, and papal influence. We're losing because we're excommunicated. So, I guess... We should grab the... Where's the military one? Um, Holy War. You have to be at war. Um, inflation reduction, I guess, could be useful. More useful would just be spending everything that we can on that, though. Alright, and Diplotech. So, we're all good there. Next problem. Lose autonomy in Magdeburg. Um, they can gain influence. Sounds fine. Alright, and I think we're going to need more mercs. We're going to afford it. Paying two and a half ducats for mercs at the moment. So we still... We are still excommunicated. How do you underdo that? It's like the second time I've ever been excommunicated. Is there a thing? <laughs> because we're excommunicated, he hates us. And he's rival to us. Fair enough. And we didn't rival him, so there's nothing we can really do. Uh, we'll just point out how wonderful we are. Guess we could... We'd have to go to war with him. And then force him to drop us as a guy. He's allied with France. He's allied with Hungary. If we declared war on Hungary... Pope, Dithmarschen, and Frankfurt. We could do that. We'd call in Denmark. We'd want to call in France. Doesn't owe us favours. Russia does, but he's in debt. 
and we'd want to do Imperial Ban when we did it. All right, so France is in another war and doesn't owe us favors. Otherwise, we could do him, and we'd want to because we want to co-belligerize. So we have eight, and we're gaining every two. All right, could be our next war, I guess, because waiting for manpower to come up. Empress Consort of the People. She's a von Habsburg. All right, lose ducats, lose admin, get unrest reduction. Or just get our legitimacy back. Unrest isn't really an issue, so let's just get legitimacy. All right, and um, didn't end up doing the things, did we? Uh, it has to be higher, so grant the monopoly charters, and then we can only get 50. Um, emissary to the Pope would give us 22, that would still not be enough. So, six support, and then just gain 100. Call a diet and gain 100. We've got a lot of military points, I'll figure them out one day. Okay. And the diplomats. Probably go to allies, subjects, and our age countries for now. Families left behind. Alright. Um, tax down, manpower down, unrest up. It's five years, we'll take the unrest hit. Bogdan has to be owned by us. Where is Bogdan? Um... Statesman's giving us Diplo rep. He's expensive. He can die. And we can grab... What's his name? Frantisek. And we'll grab Manpower. Much more useful. Alright, and yeah, we're going to build another stack of dudes. Um, put him there. Trez joined the Catholic League. Yeah. You know, Completely forgotten about the um, legs again. We got another forty odd years until it will automatically dissolve. At which point we will be dead. Where's Austrian separatists are still there? Ottomans cede to Trebizond. Holy crap! Seriously. I released Serbia. Trebizond just beat the Ottomans. Um, sure. Mamluks have um, probably paired up with Tlemcen at some point. Yeah, to beat Tunis. Inspiring liberation on Clev, really. And our diplomat died. That we literally just hired. So, let's go with another diplomat. Alright, Clev. What do they have that they're not allowed to have? Uh, we have none to send. We will in a second. Alright. Oh, yeah, we need to do Mecklenburg as well. But, declare, uh, they're allied with Russia. So, no. Keep your land. Mecklenburg. Need to get over 190. Um, because we're excommunicated, we can't. Which means... We have to pull this guy back. We have to send a gift. We need 21. Where am I looking? Send gift. 23 should do us. Alright, annex them. Free up a relationship slot. We did that so that we could start fabricating on saxe Lauenburg, Lübeck, and get through to Hamburg and Dithmarschen. Dithmarschen is the annoying one. Hmm. Don't have any excuses with them. Alright, um, aggressive expansion. Shouldn't be too bad with most of them. Nah, it's pretty low. So, uh, Lithuania. Allied with France. Damn. Guaranteed by Russia as well. Guaranteeing the Livonian order. We can't fabricate up that far. 
And we have no excuse to go to war with them. Alright. Um, Ottomans we could actually do now. We should have joined in when France was in there. We have conquest. Alright, yeah, what's our mission? Bogdan. Fair enough. So we don't want to do that until we can call Russia in, at a minimum. Uh, yeah, yeah. Russia we could call in now. I guess France we'd use against the Pope. Ooh, military. Um, let's go... Doing it this way. Lidnika. That's too expensive. Alright, give them more development. Give them more development. Give them more development. And that's probably put us over. Uh, 77. Good. Alright, the clergy need more land now because of that. So... Definitely there. Fourteen point seven, fifteen point five. Good enough, and we get more money and manpower out of it. So we will quarantine them and let them die. Absolutely. Yeah, nine years ahead. Supply limit would be good. Cavalry shock. Yeah. Um. Next idea group is at eighteen. So the one after this one. Alright, um, I assume these got evenly split. Looks like it. So, that should be good now. Um, 24 and 6 is way off, so let's start fixing these up a bit. Merge them down to... Five, uh, get rid of five. In here. Alright, 1446, 1546. Um, what am I looking for? This one. Okay, then you. Alright. 1446, 1446, equal numbers of um, mercenaries in each. Or not. So it's five and five. Okay. Access from Saxlamberg, Planet Lübeck. Hamburg, Saxlamberg. Yep, fine. <laughs> Votes are good, but that losing tons every month is annoying. So, heretics. Dithmartian, yes, we're aware. Um, actually, we've already got a thing with Dithmartian. Why have we not built up a spy network there? Don't have to go through that way. We came, took Cassell from Hess to be able to do that. Alright, and after them, Lorraine, Liege, Ulm. Ulm, we just did a thing with, didn't we? Alright, um, why should we finish annexing, maybe? Screw it. Bring this guy home. Alright, allied with Austria could be a problem. We bring in Brandenburg. Let's do that. Actually, screw it. Brandenburg's going to be more useful with other people. Let's do Denmark. And Conquest of Ulm is a go. Uh, the point of this was Dithmarschen, actually. Allied with yeah, annoying people. So, no, we just go... Do this one now. And then we don't care about the thing we did. My... Alright. Or do we want to... No. Declare that one. Keep it kind of short and sweet. And these guys wandered off too far. Thought there was something weird going on there. Um, do we have... No, that's it. One, two, three, four, five. Alright, we get these guys running over first. So, Austria is back at war with us. He's not going to get the Swedes in to help him this time. 
we'll just head straight down and we shouldn't need Brandenburg kind of close most of it's Austrian so we should be okay Mecklenburg's coming down as well. Probably going to uh, get their men soon. Alright. This guy. Three siege. Directly to Vienna. And everyone wants to give us their Condottieri. Now, money's still positive. Who are we actually at war with? Was it Austria, Liege, and Siena? Yeah, I think we'll be fine. Well, the edge has come straight in. And Ulm has gone next door. Lost our master recruiter. I guess that's fine if we wanted Fort Defense. No. Let's get our manpower guy again. More recruitment. And Russia's doing the Ottomans. Which means we don't get to call them into our war. And we can't get over to Steiermark. I guess we should just go straight to the hills of Ulm. Would rather kill a few armies first. Um, so I want to get Dithmarschen out of this. So let's kill their army. And then go next door. Again, the Austrians are going to cause issues if they come over to do these guys. But we'll just take Vienna and then wander off somewhere else to the little guys. Okay, they love us. <clears throat> and we ran into these guys by accident, but we're about to win. Good. So we get for doing Mecklenburg. And fortification effort in the Poodle. Yes. Now, we've got tons of military power, so why are we not ordering barrages left, right and centre? Order an assault. No way. Just give us the extra chance. Alright, as the Austrians come down our way. Well, we've won Vienna, so that's why you do that. Um, Canton. Kind of want to see where they're going to go first. I guess we can sit on Steiermark for a bit. He's going to do that. We'll just take this and then uh, work our way back down south. And no, the Austrians stop somewhere else this time. Oh, one Death Martian. Good. So, down to Stad. Sitting in Steiermark. And I think we uh, want to get started, even though it's mountains. And his army's probably nearby. Haven't seen him walk out again. The Danes are coming down. Ulm's uh, coming to... Yeah, he was actually going to do it. But Mecklenburg is integrated. So, all good. Um, Bohemia, we do want to keep relations up with. Alright, and in here we will order the barrage. Alright, he blocked us from getting through, but now we're fine. So, uh, Mecklenburg. You had your guys up there. Good enough. Do you want to mend them with this one, or... yeah. You know they'll die if we don't. And army-wise, still about the same as it was at the start. La Plata is Castilian. Alright, take the start. Get down to Paderborn. Order the barrage. What is our military gain? Nine. Alright, cannon fodder. Gain manpower, Bohemia gain, liberty desire, and opinion goes down. Well, that's annoying because if it wasn't for the opinion one, we'd do it. But it's going to take... Well, you know what. They'll have a separate timer for coming off. Tyrant, overlord, 25 years. Won't be able to do the um, thing in that time anyway. Alright, taking Canton. 
South Tyrol or Tyrol? I think we just go straight to Tyrol. Somebody else can backfill. And recall from Bohemia. Oh, this is the wrong religion around here. We lost Vernonburg. Seriously. Dithmarsh and Goddess. Um, yeah, who should we be fabricating on? I'm thinking Frankfurt. We can't reach them. We're at war with Liege. Yeah, forgot about them. An Austrian army. Uh, what is this? Hopefully planes. It's woods. We should be relatively safe there then. Can't help him out with the barrage. And Austria's debts are getting paid by Britain. Bamberg comes under attack. Yep, they're going to have a little trouble doing much of that before we finish down here. I thought we would already done the barrage there. That was Canton. Alright. And Dithmartians up in Dithmartian. So... The point with them was going to be enforcing religion. Then I guess if we can take a province as well. Or two. Or three. We leave him with... Westphalen. Um, we swap them around. Pretty sure we should be able to call that being the emperor. That would be nice. So we're going to have to take this fort, obviously, and then probably have to kill his army as well. The fact that Ulm and Liege are there is annoying. But we've taken Paderborn, so can we do this now? We can. Okay. Um, too many issues with that. If we wait until next year, a few of them will come down. What if we took Dithmarschen instead of Stad? We still fabricate on the same things. Alright, Stad is 16 development, Dithmarschen is 15. It's actually good. So, yeah, we'll have to hang around until next year, which means we're going to kill them and then come back down this way. Oh, he's going to be cheeky. If he wants to die over there, that's fine by us. But I'm going to take a short break here. So thanks for watching. Hope you're enjoying it. And I hope to see you again soon. See you later.